we're going to Hudson. So first day. First day of kindergarten. You say bye Hudson? Bye Hudson. <laughs> Have fun, sis. Hudson is off to school. We are hanging out, waiting for Casey's sister to get here to watch this guy. Casey and I are headed to Hudson's school to talk to Hudson's classmates about her. To explain to them that, you know, explain her. G-tube that's in her belly and how she eats and why she doesn't talk and just explain her to them so that they understand her. take you to Miss class and that will be fun. You'll be there for a morning meeting and you'll get to meet all of the other kindergartners. All right. You excited? Give me a big old high five. Oh, yay. <laughs> 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 all right. Well, I think that went well. We are leaving Hudson School. Casey, could you ever be an elementary school teacher? Mm, no. <laughs> like 40 little domics all in one room and <laughs> everyone talks at the same time and yeah you know but I, random uh, thoughts all over the place <laughs> i think she's happy in there she's super happy and she's very uh, smiley so headed back to the house i forgot to bring some of her things some important things like a change of clothes so taking casey home to her car so she can go to work and I am rushing back home and so I can grab the stuff and rush back over here and drop it off but so far an exciting day Got the monkey back there. Got Hudson stuff. Hauling it back to the school. <sighs> back and forth, back and forth. Um, update though, just got a phone call from Enterprise, which rented us this van from the accident on my van. And uh, so hopefully everything's done on Friday. But I wanted to, one thing that irks me is this guy was at 100% fault. For running into us and so his insurance covers our rental van but I have to pay like $15 a day for insurance on this van so on Friday hopefully we get our van back that I return this rental vehicle I owe $215 in insurance coverage for this rental van so why I'm out of pocket I don't know, but... Uh, stuff dropped off at Hudson School. Now headed back home. I've got to figure something out. I had a doctor's appointment scheduled for today, not realizing that Hudson got out of school early. Doctor's appointment at 1.30, Hudson School lets out at 1.30. I don't know what I'm going to do. I <laughs> I guess I'm going to cancel my doctor's appointment and try to reschedule it. Unless I can find somebody to get Hudson off the bus. I don't think that's going to happen. 
do a lot of driving around today. Hudson Ann, just returning home from kindergarten. How was it? Did you have fun today with your first day at kindergarten? You did? All right. That's good. It's good to see you smiling when you come home. All right. All right. Well, you ready to get out of your chair? We'll go upstairs and hang out. Wednesdays is your early day. Tomorrow you're going to have to be there a lot longer. Well, okay. Good news. My doctor's appointment was for next week. Downside of that, it was... What did I come in here for? Downside of that is it's still next Wednesday, which means Hudson still gets out of school early and I have Dominic, and so I scheduled it wrong. So I rescheduled it. I There was a check that I thought I had to drive. Our bank is 20 miles south of here, and I thought I had to drive there to deposit the check. Turns out that she's able to like take a picture of it and just deposit it that way. My afternoon opened up, and now with the in-laws coming this weekend, Casey going out of town, I've got to go to the grocery store and get us back up to par, basically, on what we have in here. So, kids and I are headed to Costco and Price Chopper. It seems like Costco and Price Chopper are a theme of this vlog, but it's I'm a stay-at-home dad. I go there at least once a week, so there is that. All right, grocery list. Made? Yes, you ready to go? Yes. Good. Hudson, are you ready to go? <laughs> I think so. All right. Those were all kids. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm going to get in my car seat. You want to get in your car seat? Are you ready to go to Price Chopper? Good. Costco done. Now we are at Price Chopper. Are you kids ready to go to Price Chopper? Yeah. You ready to get some groceries? Yeah. You ready to eat something good for dinner? Yeah. What about you, Hudson Ann? Yeah, I thought so. It's small smiles, but they're smiles. Price Chopper is they about 80% of the time offer me help out of the car. I always refuse it. I mean, I, I got it. But it is pretty awesome that they offer. Working on some taco meat right there. All my own seasoning, not a taco seasoning. Gonna have some guacamole with the tomatoes and the lime and the onion. And uh, Casey's gonna have a taco salad. It was gonna be tacos, but all the tacos in the package are broken. I think there might be two that are complete in there. You know, today was pretty crazy. Hudson going to kindergarten, being up at basically seven o'clock in the morning trying to get, trying to make sure that everyone is ready to go and Casey changing her plan up to go with me to the school to talk to Hudson's class. Trying to talk to kindergartners that are in their basically second day, third day of school and explain complex needs of Hudson. It was it was funny. Both Casey and I asked a question because we're so used to talking to more of a, of adults. And I think Casey asked if 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 any of the kids knew of somebody in a wheelchair. And there were every it seemed like every kid knew somebody in a wheelchair and there was especially one kid down front that I don't think he stopped talking. He, he continued to talk while we were talking for the full 10 minutes that, that we were up there and explained to us that his grandpa is in a wheelchair but he doesn't need it all the time and his arms work and his legs work but he's in the, you know, it was this whole 
wide open story about about his papa. And uh, so it was, it was really cute. So definitely an interesting day. I really wish I could have gotten video in there. I, I, I may have included something in this clip about, I don't know, but it was, it, it, if it's anything, it's 10 seconds long or it's a photo montage.